Hi, uh, good afternoon, Coach. Uh, good afternoon, Jigsen. Hello, good afternoon. Welcome to Kerala Blasters pre-match press conference. Today we have our head coach, Kibu Utpuna, and the player, Jigsen Singh. Uh, the floor is open for the questions. Martin, uh, Srinath, you can go ahead with the questions. Yeah, hi, uh, hi, Coach. Uh, hi, Jackson. Uh, so, Coach, uh, big game uh, tomorrow uh, against Mumbai. Uh, like, you know, what kind of a challenge are you expecting? Uh, uh, because uh, they are a team that likes to play very attacking, offensive, position-based football. So, how are you looking at uh, tackling them? Hello, good afternoon. Well, it's, uh, it's the leader of the competition. It's, uh, we know that he's a very good team, with very good players, uh, good coach. Uh, you know, it's a big challenge for us, especially after our last ga game at, against uh, ATK. Uh, we, have to, we have to come back. We want to come back and, and get the boys tomorrow. Uh, coach, uh, just a follow-up question. Uh, like you know, uh, from your time at Mohan Bagan, we have seen that you like to, you also like to play position-based football. You like to play, do you, you like to play out from the back. But uh, uh, yeah, this season we have seen that you are a little bit more adaptable. You know? So in that sense, uh, would you like to? Are you open to sort of? Sitting back and defending and hitting on the counter, uh, read the situation and uh, and base your game upon that. Like you know, or you still like to stick to that philosophy of position-based football. How how has the style changed this season for you compared to last season? It's different because uh, different teams, uh, different players, uh, but the the main the main. Uh, the main aspect of the studies are the same. I think we are we are an offensive team. We are uh, especially in the last match we are creating chances. We are scoring goals. We have to improve our defensive phase. Uh, we are adaptable. We have different plans. Uh, for example, in the last two games, we have more the possession of the game than the opponent. We are still creating chances, but we we got only one point in the last two games, uh, creating more chances than the opponent, uh, especially in the games against Jansen Food. Uh, but um, we are still uh, we are still working. We are still improving, and we have to. We are working to to get the the correct balance. Thank you, thank you, coach. Welcome. Thank you, Martin. Uh, who would like to go next? Shall I ask? Yes, in that boy. Kibu coach, uh, good afternoon. Good afternoon. Uh, coach, anything about the refereeing uh, as you feel? Uh, are you feeling any uh, discomfort in ISL refereeing? Which means all Kerala Blasters fans are very much uh, disappointed with this uh, refereeing, which we, um, we are considering penalties, which uh, we, they don't deserve, actually. And what are your thoughts on it? I don't want to talk about referees. Uh, I think we have to focus on the game. Uh, yes. It's the only thing that we can we, we can, we can do. Uh, we respect the we respect the referees. Uh, we respect that they, that they are a very important part of the game, and that's all. I don't want to talk about. I want to talk about the about the game. I want to talk about football. I want to talk about our team. Um, and I think that we have to we have to focus in what we can. And what we can do is to, to play better, to, to play well, and to, to try to do our best to get the points. Yes, coach, yes. And uh, what we, we have seen in the second half of last day's match, uh, some sort of uh, dis undisciplinary actions from our and uh, ATK Mohan Bagan players. And uh, what are your thoughts on it? Uh, is it good for a professional club? Uh, sorry, could you repeat, please? I don't understand the question. Uh, in the middle of the pitch, uh, we had a fight in the middle of the pitch last day. And what are your thoughts on it? 
is part uh, is part of the part of the game. I mean, uh, I don't I don't want to talk about about that. Something something happened. Uh, I, what I, what can I say? It is I'm, I'm very proud of of the team. Uh, the team I'm uh, I'm leading. I'm very proud of the players, uh, of the behavior in the in the in the pitch, in the behavior of 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 the pitch. We have a fantastic group of persons, a fantastic group of people, and that's uh, only what can I say. Yes, yes, yes. yes. Uh, we have got the lead in the first half, just in the first half with the two goals, and uh, we have lost the three points in the second half, which we have played. A fantastic match in the first half, and uh, we didn't get the rhythm in the second half. And uh, what were the problems actually in your mind? What were the problems uh, affected us in the second half? I think that we play very well 60 minutes. 60 minutes, not only the oh, first half. You minutes. Know, you see the you see the game till the till the first goal. No, football is a question also of of, of energies of of, of moods. Uh, I think we were clearly better 60 minutes. Uh, we, we even with 2-0, we were controlling the game, and after the first goal, the energy changed. Uh, we we had doubts. Uh, they started to believe that they, they, they could get the, they could get the points, and the match was uh, was more even. But um, it's a question if you see the statistics, the the chances, similar chances from from both teams, position of the game more for us. Um, it's, it was very very hard to, to digest that we we lost we lost last game, especially when uh, when you are playing good football, you are creating chances, you are scoring goals, and in 30 minutes we lost we lost the game. But I don't think that is uh, uh, nothing physical, nothing nothing tactical. It was more about uh, small uh, small details, no? Even the, it was, it's not that they, they they were clearly better than us. They 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 took advantage of the chances they. They had and, and and we did it because we have in the first half we, we have very 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 clear chances to score. Yes, yes, yes. And uh, what are the uh, analysis about Juande, uh, our new player? Is he trading well? Sorry. About Juande, our uh, new uh, player, new signing. I don't understand. Juande. About Juande, our new player. Yeah, what what happened with him? Sorry, sir. So what about our player, our new player, new signing, Juvante? But what what do you want to, to know about him? My uh, my opinion? Is, ah yes, your opinion about that player. He's a good he's a, he's a good player, he's a he's a he's a player that we are very happy with him because uh, he's inside the team uh, since the first uh, day in the in, in the field and out of the the field. Fantastic teammate. He's performing with his, uh, with his experience in the field line and he's helping the team. Yes, yes, yes. and uh, thank you, coach. Good luck for the next match. Thank you. Thank you, Srinath. I request all of you to uh, share your uh, questions with the player, Jason, as well. Yeah, hi. Can I ask a question to Jason? Yeah, Martin, please. Yeah. Uh, hi, Jason. Uh, so, ever since you broke into the team, you have been uh, going from strength to strength. Uh, so, but uh, we are seeing that collectively the team has not been able to sort of hold on to leads, you know, like, you know, like how the coach said uh, the team has been creating chances, scoring goals. So, how do you analyze the team's uh, defensive performance? Uh, uh, and uh, like, you know, how do you think you can improve and, you know, uh, get results, uh, hold on to leads and uh, win matches? Like like we saw against ATP. Yeah, I think like uh, as we all know, like uh, we had uh, like some good like performance. I think we should take positive things from that, and uh, we should keep going. Like it's happened in the football. Like if you are playing well, and like in some mistake, you can get lost. So, like but it's in football, so like we should keep going and we should take positive things from the previous matches and uh, yeah, keep going forward. Jixon, so you have uh, played as a you know, played in the defensive midfield uh, position. You have played as a centre back. So, what do you actually prefer? Like, which is your uh, ideal position that you like to play? In? 
I think the both uh, position is almost similar. Like uh, in defender, like I have only a uh, goalkeeper behind me. So I can uh, take too much risks. And in midfielder, I can uh, take some risks uh, because I have uh, four defender and goalkeeper. So uh, that's the only different other things like uh, almost similar. And uh, what are you expecting against Mumbai? Like, you know, uh, your last match also, you played well. There were some defensive mistakes because of which you lost the match early on, maybe. So, from that uh, match, what are you learning? Uh, what are the talking learning points that you think you can use uh, this time against them? Uh, they are a good team. Uh, they are top of the like league. And uh, we also have been like training well. And like uh, we'll try to keep our best uh, to get three points from this game also. Okay, okay. Thanks, Jackson. Just a quick question to the coach. Uh, uh, coach, uh, Blasters have been playing so many matches uh, in quick succession. Uh, do you think that that has been a concern for you in terms of uh, uh, fatigue? You know, uh, do you think the players are maybe fatigued? How do you look at uh, players, the team playing so many matches together? Yes, it's true that we play in January, we play eight games. Uh, I think it's too much. And also, we have not uh, enough time sometimes not to recover from one uh, one game or another. No, because we play Sunday night. We are going to play Wednesday Wednesday night. But uh, we are a professional team, and we have to handle with this with this situation. No, I think that uh, that we are uh, physically prepared to 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 manage. Uh, this uh, this marathon of, ma of matches, um, and uh, and we are ready to to face uh, Mumbai City tomorrow. Okay, okay. Thank you. Thank you, Martin. Anyone would like to ask? Uh. Yeah, can I ask? Uh, yeah, Martin. Martin. Yeah, uh, coach, I just wanted to know why Jessel has not been able to finish uh, matches because, uh, like, you know, he plays for, uh, he doesn't complete 90 minutes. Is there any reason for that? Is it a fitness issue or uh, some practical issue? What is it? No, he, he normally plays 90 minutes. But in the, in the last game, it was, a, it was a tactical change. No, no problem at all. Okay, okay. Uh, and Jackson, uh, you'll be facing uh, Ogbeche, you know, your old teammate. Uh, so, how, how do you look at that? Like, you know, that will be a big contest, uh, Ogbeche versus the Kerala Blasters defense. Uh, so, any, any particular plans for him? What do you think his game is like? You know, how do you think you can uh, nullify his threat? Yeah, he's uh, like, I used to like call him like a, a brother, like always, like when I talk to him, like. He's like my brother, and uh, he's a good player. And yeah, uh, it will be like good to play against him and uh, try to defend him. That's only. Okay. Thank you, Martin. And Nishan, Sudish, Hari, you guys would like to ask any questions? Hi, well, I'm not feeling well. That's why I'm refraining from asking. Uh, so sorry. Well, I just I just want to say uh, all the best uh, for uh, Kibu and Jigsen and for the uh, other players for tomorrow's game. All the best. Thank you very much. But what's happening? Yeah, hi, coach. You, you have problems? Yeah, coach. Uh, I have a throat ache and uh, fever, so not feeling well. Yeah. Thank, Thank you. Thank you. All the best. Yeah. Hi, coach. Uh, Nishant here from Gold.com. I missed the first few minutes, so I'm not sure you answered this question already, but I'm going to ask uh, ask you again. So, um, uh, you have, what do you? Uh, I just want to know your thoughts on the mid-season transfer. So there are a lot of clubs in the January transfer window. They've gone ahead and, you know, some of the, they've been swap deals. One player, you know, ex player exchanges, one player going the other way, uh, etc. For example, recently, Lenny Rodriguez joined ATK Mohan Bagan. So a um, lot of changes like that. So what do you think this does to the playoff race? Does it make any sort of impact? Because 
the teams around you have made a lot of changes in their squad so do you feel a bit uh, behind in the race and do you what what are your general thoughts on these mid season signings uh, 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 generally nothing nothing to say you know i mean every every team try to to improve their teams uh, to make some uh, some some changes uh, to, to improve their teams um, this this is normal in, in every in every winter market you know Yes, coach. I just want to ask you if you um, uh, were planning for, for some Kerala Blasters, uh, were you interested in any signings, or were you totally happy with the squad that you have? We have uh, our team is uh, we have uh, enough players. We are uh, we are uh, happy with the players we have. Uh, it's true that uh, we have to make some changes because of injury, the injury of. Of Sergio Tidons and uh, Juan de Juan de Kane, and there's this this change between Subagos and 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 Nandan Manavrel, and that's all. Do anything, anything more? Uh, we register Mukta, and and that's all. Yeah, thank you, Coach. Uh, best wishes. Thank you. Thank you, Nishant. Rishi bhai, can I go again? Yeah, ma'am. Yeah, coach. Uh, just a question about uh, transfers itself. Uh, now you said that you're happy with the squad, but do you think that at least maybe the uh, the club can think about holding on to some of the players who have performed, like for example Jordan Murray uh, or some of those kind of players? Do you think maybe the club should uh, think right away uh, of uh, signing them on a long term deal or something like that? Because uh, uh, we saw last season that some of the uh, players who performed well left the club and they're doing well for other teams. So do you think the club should uh, should avoid Right, mistake this season. Do you think that can be planned right now? I have to. We have to focus in tomorrow's game. We are not talking about uh, what is going to have uh, next season, and this is not our job. Um, my job is to to prepare to tomorrow's game as best as possible, and to 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 get ready to to, to be ready for for uh, for uh, fight for to for tomorrow's game, to fight for for get the three points. Okay. Okay. Thank you, Martin. Yeah, I believe, uh, Coach. Uh, we don't have anything uh, uh, to ask actually. So, thank you so much for sparing some time, and all the best. For tomorrow's match, thank you, Coach, and all the best, Jackson, for tomorrow's match. Thank you all. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. All the best, guys. Thank, thank you. Have a nice day. Bye bye.